Dave Garcia here, UT Abbey Moab, and we've entered the classic low probability, high consequence scenario. Our last avalanches were on February 7th and our last snow on February 9th. With each passing day, it becomes less likely to trigger an avalanche on the deeply buried persistent weak layer. However, if you did trigger one of these avalanches, they would be very deep, dangerous, and potentially deadly. More and more people, including myself, are starting to step out into more avalanche terrain. I am personally skiing in areas where I know the snowpack is deep. I am probing 200 centimeters or more in some places. You are most likely to trigger an avalanche in areas with a shallow snowpack. Very steep, rocky terrain in the Alpine is above my personal level of risk tolerance right now. What I would like to see is another storm with significant snowfall and a good amount of snow water content. And if we get a storm like that with no avalanches failing down on that deeply buried PWL, that'll have me feeling really good about conditions. In the meantime, I'm erring on the side of caution. So thank you for watching and please keep it tuned to the Moab forecast page for the latest updates.